Hey guys, what's going on? Um, I sound like so Australian. Hey, well, hey, what's going on, Matt? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, that's when I do an Australian voice, I automatically swear, and I caught myself there because I don't know Australian swear. Um, okay, I'm gonna get serious now. So. This video today is more of a serious one than I would normally do, but it's something that's been on my mind for a little while, and I've, I've contemplated whether I should share it with you. And in the end, I've decided that I should. I'm gonna to talk to you about breakups. Now, if any of you have followed me on across social media, you may have been aware that uh, I am no longer posting photos with my girlfriend, and that's because we broke up a few months ago. I didn't really go public with this and announce it, because I didn't think it was something that needed to be announced. Um, it's not a huge deal to anyone but Rihanna and I, um, and it's something I should, thought I should kind of keep for ourselves. And I'm not gonna go into the details of it, we just grew apart. Um, we're very, very different people in, in some ways, very similar to others, but those things sort of were coming in, in between us now, and rather than turning into a hate-filled relationship, we, we thought it's best to go separate ways and uh, hopefully grow up, so then we can maybe, I don't know, work on being better people. So, that's that. Um, but, I've been thinking about it, I thought I would share with you kind of just my opinions on what it means to be not single but how to deal with a breakup and not necessarily a breakup but just a negative experience and um, not many people have known that I, I, we broke up because I haven't really announced it. I also have presented a pretty uh, a brave face essentially. I've tried to be a positive role model, um, a positive influence in what I'm doing still without being moping. Um, I guess that's part of being like a, an influencer is that I, I am aware that people do look to me to, to be aspirational um, and, and follow it. I don't know, I try to be a good example. So I would hate people to see me wallowing in my own self misery and, and sadness and loneliness and think that's okay and that's the way it's to be. And because it's not, breakups can suck. They can be bitter and horrible and um, just between you and I, just just you and I. Um, I miss Rihanna like crazy to be honest. I think it's hard because I still love her, I still care about her, but it just wasn't in our best interest to stay together anymore. It doesn't make it any easier. Um, how I've dealt with that though is by painting a brave face, by getting out there and trying to be in the moment and experience life and continue on being the best person that I can be because otherwise, what good am I? <laughs> I mean, you're always gonna go through tough things and I think it's, it's, it's how we act that defines who we are. So, I, I'm kind of stealing a lot from Batman there. It's not who I am underneath the mask, it's what I do that defines me. It's my Batman voice, by the way. But I think it's very true. I think it's our actions that define who we are and it's that that shows strength. So rather than being down and being sad and being depressed and, and focusing on the negatives that come with a breakup, I'm being positive. I'm looking to the amazing things in my life, the amazing people, and you are part of that. You have kept me sane and kept me happy, so I'm so thankful for that. And I think if anyone out there that is going through a breakup, that is being broken up with, that is just lonely, know that there are some amazing people in the world and they care about you and that all hope is not lost. The sun's gonna come out tomorrow, unless it's a rainy day, in which case, just wait for the next day, it'll be fine. Um, things will be good, and I know it can be tough, but it's about looking to those those brighter days and those brighter things in our lives, and that's what keeps us going. So, I'm not gonna teach you exactly how to do it. I have no idea. I'm still struggling. Breakups always suck, they're always hard. But, as I said, it's about focusing on the good things that we've got going on for us. So, there's a bit of honesty for you. Um, I just want you to know that yeah, everyone goes through it. I might paint a brave face and I might paint this happy person, but there've been times I'm struggling. There's those late nights when you're sitting by yourself and you're just like, you're all caught up in here and it can be hard to admit that to yourself that you really miss someone you care about them, but that's okay. It's fine to do that, but it's about being, at the end of the day, a positive person and doing things that are gonna be positive for you and for everyone around you. That's the way to improve and that's the way to get through these things. So, stay strong. You're amazing. I love you. I care about you and you're gonna do great things with someone without them it's all in you <laughs>